Animals pay a heavy price for wildlife crime. Illegal fishing, poaching, wildlife smuggling and habitat destruction are rampant, but tackling the criminal gangs responsible stretches wealthy governments, let alone poor countries with limited funds. Since 2011, Earthrace has been assisting in some of the hardest hit areas. Our team provides training of local units. We provide equipment such as Zodiacs, Amphibs, drones and night vision. We hire local helicopters and planes to run surveillance from. But most of all, we help them catch people involved in wildlife crimes. We've made numerous busts in illegal fishing. Our team caught a trawler operating illegally in a marine reserve in Costa Rica, and the captain turned out to be the president of a commercial fishermen's association. We chased shark finners all the way to Cocos Island, catching seven of them in a single night. We found a number of boats operating illegally in the Coral Triangle, including this one, with over 15 tonne of fish, much of it endangered or protected. Another area we've worked on is the illegal wildlife trade. We closed down several gangs in Asia smuggling endangered animals such as pangolin, forest turtles and sea turtles back to China. Some of our missions are more about exposing illegal or excessively cruel activity. In Namibia, we covertly filmed their barbaric seal clubbing and since then have been running a publicity campaign there to try and get the industry closed down. In other missions, it's about saving individual animals. This dolphin was being held illegally in a tiny little swimming pool. We rescued her, took her to a sea pen we'd built, and she was nurtured back to health and successfully released. These missions are not without risk. In Corcovado National Park, our team twice came under gunfire while chasing illegal gold miners. In both cases, we were successful in making arrests, but our team do put their lives on the line. The point I make is our team has delivered on saving wildlife, despite many challenges. We don't talk about conservation, rather we get out there and actually do it. And with your help, we can do so much more.